Tell me what's happening with the Jabiru line these days. Uh, yeah, so we've got uh, over 2,500 aircraft flying around the world now and have delivered over 7,000 engines. So, uh, and over the 35 year history, the, uh, the company's got some good legs underneath it now. Model wise, uh, we're standing next to the J230D, which is the current model line as an SLSA, a two seat, three door, three human sized doors. This airplane also comes in a four seat model. Both aircraft use the six cylinder, 120 horsepower air cooled direct drive engine. In the four seat model, it uses the same human sized third door. You don't have a four place airplane where you've got to crawl, crawl through one of the front doors to get to the back seats. There's a giant door in the back that humans and big old dogs can crawl through, or humans can load their camping equipment or their bicycles or their wheelchairs into uh, to make their traveling easier and more enjoyable. The engine series, there's <clears> been a, a fairly decent following for both a four and a six cylinder solution. At one time there was an eight cylinder solution, which unfortunately has been withdrawn, but uh, sure would have a place in this market. What's the future of the engine series right now? Well, it's been real strong. We're in the fourth iteration or the generation four engine, but popular now are the four-cylinder and the six-cylinder engines, the four-cylinder is an 85 horse, and that engine's popular in South Africa and Australia and in Europe, but in the United States, the six-cylinder is way more popular. The Gen 4 engine is a great compilation of everything that was learned on the generations one, two, and three engines. All the service bulletins and advancement are put into this engine, as well as it's an all cast aluminum engine. Um, uh, one other uh, significant change that was done was combining the cylinder head to the barrel, which the earlier generation engines didn't have. You could take the cylinder head off. And that with the all uh, cast aluminum engine and nickel sill cylinders for places like Florida or the West Coast uh, really helped protect the engine from corrosion and it's really working out very well. And of course the big news this past year was kit availability. That's what we're real excited about this year is bringing uh, the two seat and more importantly the four seat kits into the United States. Uh, like any good four place aircraft it'll hold three adults or two adults and two kids. Cost wise how do they compare? You'll be very well equipped for under 200000 in the four-seat configuration. And the two-seat? Runs as an SLSA at 175, factory built, ready to fly, very well equipped. Along with the kit, we offer a kit a builder assistance center, two two-week sessions. At the end of the second two-week session, you've got the airworthiness certificate. And that uh, people are gravitating towards that because they get the airplane completed. With this program, within two or three months, you're flying. There you go. Thank you so much, Scott. Appreciate your time for Airborne and Aero News and uh, the Sun Fudge D Digital Daily. Yep. Thanks so much, Jim. Thanks for everything you're doing out here.